brothers and sisters, faith without action is dead. Ang pagtuo nga diliubanan o maayong buhat patay. Faith and action must always be together. They cannot be separated. These two are twins. One cannot live without the other because God has joined them together. In James 2.24, it says, You see, then, that it is by our action that we are put right with God and not by our faith alone. And even in verse 26, it says, So then, as the body without spirit is dead, also faith without action is dead. Therefore, brothers and sisters, faith without action is dead. May kadlaw ka na itong tanang. Niya nasab kita na yun ang itong paboritong programang Faith in Action. Lain nga episode nga among ihatag ka ninyo nga a very special episode, no? Nga ang mubat-bat o klaro ani si Sister Malo. Madam? Ay, may ganda. Hala, sa'yo kayo tanag. So, good. Good morning, Ty. Good morning sa itong viewers sa Faith in Action. So, lahi na po din nga programa karon ron. Kay Bao, as always, no? Ang atong mga mga kasinatian, mga sugilano na itong magkuhaan o pagtulunan and inspiration as it always is the case sa atong mga programa sa Faith in Action. Pero karong buntaga, medyo kuan, artistahin ang ato ang bisita. O niya, familiar ni nako kay kanang, pinangga ni nako, no? But wako kabaw kung unsay mga mga details that will come out nga itunol's Holy Spirit aning atong episode karong buntaga so sama sa naandan siya gyud mo pa ila-ila siya ang kaugalingon good morning hi good morning miss malu good morning tay <laughs> oh ipaila-ila imong self okay. um my name is Hana Esguera i am a member of the Ways of Love community and uh, i used to be part of the youth ministry sa uh, what is youth Youth ministry. I, youth. I used to youth. be. Ah, I used. Sorry. I used to be. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm part of the youth ministry. <laughs> You're still you. Ah, yes. uh, bitaw. Still young time. Just like me. Ah, de ba gay? Give chance. Kaya nengo mo sila nga life start at 50. Mm. No, so before 50, that's an old age of youth. But after 50, that's a youth age of old. Nga di ano din ha? Di ba? Sige, go. Yes, always. Oh, bitaw, tanawa nga nung youth man. Kanin kaya? Asa makaganaan magkuantay? Mag-start? Well, I have to start from the beginning. Telison man kay tell end na ka ba? You have to start from the beginning. In her younger age, kanang kung sa may mga activities si mo inyong mga escapade no mga you know kay ibaw ka mga kini ako ng partner marites mong oy dili ko marites lahi tus marites ay iba kung sa mina na marites mare ito na ang latest ano ang latest ah de ba ikaw tay tolit sa dekat tay tolit oh So, ato tama ni start sa teenager life, no? Teenager? Oh, okay, sige. Okay. Teenager pa mga yaman na. Dere, dere, dere man, dere man lang kajut sa sibu ng dako, no? Yes, nai. We are good. We are a family of five. So I have nakoy do ka may pixel on. So nakoy kuya o nakoy mga mod. So nakoy sa Mendo. And then we grew up here in Cebu. In my younger days, uh, in my in my early education, I'm right. My parents really sent me to great Catholic schools, so Kinder, Saint Mary, Mary Immaculate, and then um, grade school. Di ko sa Immaculada. Aso Immaculada de ka grade school. Grade school, yes. Mm. And then high school, um, Sacred Heart Jesuit. Mm. Uh, uh, so, um, ang amo ang um, Amo ang growth and development really evolved around the Catholic teachings. Mm -hmm. So, 
Uh, ang foundation kay Kuan Gyud, Catholic schools. Yeah. Pero dili man ex exclusive ba? Exclusive school for girls? Daga man ang klaseng foundation. No? Daga ang klaseng foundation. Oh. Na, na, na NGO. <laughs> na say make up. <laughs> Ala ha, tatay. <laughs> Onya, so how was life ka nang, sa imuhang teenage years? Unsa man imuhang lingaw or you know, what was life back then? Life back then, um, simpler. Wala wala lang pa din ako sa mga cellphone so magduwa mi outside nakabot pa ko ang age yeah. you know lilingaw na kay ko nang paritero tago-tago growing up and then um, slowly the, the technology was introduced so kinda, um, it was a nice childhood nice teenage years and um adin na sa high school medyo um, you know uh, things get a bit more complicated kaya mas naanak kayo buot. Hindi, mm. <laughs> ayun na. Ni Adi ka complicated. During that time, wala pa ning cellphone o wala, wala. pa um, Later pa. Nagka-cellphone ko tayo, I was, uh, wala. Graduating na siguro ko to high school. So, during the uh, elementary before that, duwa pa siya, tubig, tubig pa siya tayo. Saya na Suka, mau mana aja no, niya ka ng biko-biko, step no, step no, mana mana no. I just know pa ang time at all. Nindot pa biya tong, you know, muna kita huwag handurawo ni mo ang mga nangagi sa tong kinabuhi ba. Dito na tong makita ng tinood ng Pilipin hong kinabuhi. Sa balak man si tatay. Iisad ko nung kinabuhi at tatay, simple rako no. Okay, karon gamit mo itong mga SIM card. During those times, SIM card. Lahit po ito tayo. Lahit po ito siya. Oh, thank you. So that was it. My teen years. And then, college happened. Oh, yeah. Medyo, we have access to slowly being introduced to new technology. The transfer of information. May hindi na introduce na sa itong system. And so, mas na-open ato ang, at least for me, like a home world to the global scale, or kinas online. So, ito, but, you know, we still use technology like research, and that's a lot of education, so, what's up with that? During, we are talking during the college na. Catholic school, gaya po na siya nag-college. Yes, it's college. I think it's best to, Discuss about our love life. Oh God! Oh God! Yeah. Love life. In my, in my time, I used to collect, and then I select, uh. and then I will lick. Ah, ayo, ayo, na. Ano <laughs> lahi na ko? Ilabay, isalikway. No? So mangulik taka girls. Klaro kung yun ane mo da. Ano yun mo da ng ipang salikway? Ako ko an magko kanang collection, ganahan ko yung collection items. Oh, lagi. So, ano siya mo yung pang kulit tahon? Sa istang. Ah, so, dili, girls. Leave it to the imagination. Tay, ha? Actually, Tay, I don't know if you would buy, but all throughout my college, I just connect that. Boyfriend. Actually, abin na ko, Tay, Magmadre ni siya pag college niya. Teacher na ako sa college, si Ms. Malone. Because nasya ko sa akong klase, siya ragyod ang what ni take og exam kay mag-recollection siya. So sa akong... Si tatay yung tatay. But you know, nakayon ko. Na-proud said ko ato niya tayo. Uy, bisag na hibong ko ba? Wow, akong subject kay... I don't know what kind of teacher I am, but but ang ako mga sujanti kasi garan kay ako mong taga ang choice if I'm absent or di. But siya ni choose gin siya at itay ng mo absent kin siya kay mag ko an siya mag recollection siya. So simply na kaingon sa ko nga amazing sa for for a young lady no to be that aware and to be that strong in her faith nga ko an siya. So during that time she's in a business ko ano no circle kay. Wala pa. Kaya, huwag dili ka ka-collect, mag-recollect mo sa mga... Lain po ito tayo, dili collection tayo, recollection. Imo ha ito. WJS. I think WJS to, no? I think so. Murag. Okay. But, dili, sad all the time na I was really that kuan in in the faith. During that time lang yun, I was in search. In college, I just felt so empty. Adi ay? Yeah, na I was longing ba because 
uh, among household at that time was also getting pretty relaxed. Ba? Ani mga good work. Catholic, you get into the routine so much about mm. the church. Yinana. So eventually, mag, during my college years, what I remember was, did not have anything. We're not doing anything bad. Ah, so nakampante ka. Kanang typical uh, Catholic school, born and bred nga. Uh, Kaya rin well, ko, ko ah. <laughs> She started the uh, spiritual life in their family. Mm. Everybody was back to God because of her, no? Uh, more than, <laughs> yes, uh, I, I know this uh, time, no? In fact, si Gito Gahangyo na ko si Brad Knapp, no? Brad Knapp kay Lab, siguro mo, Dr. Knapp, mm. baliho na ni mo, pan. pan. <laughs> so, muna yung hangyo nga ipasood yun kay sirado naman ta to. Mm. Um, so, ah, so mo'y nag-push nga mo, appeal oh, sila. Appeal niya, then everything was change in their family. Siyam jay kadala sa mm. balik sa gino sa pamilya. Sa entire family. Um, you know, it's yun ane, sad to say nga sometimes una kung ina nga you always think of the kingdom mm. but you forget the king. No? Sige lang tanga kung ano income na to income. Una Kalimta na ito sa inyo ng atong mga income. Kalimta na ito ang pag-serve sa... Dili, kanang tawhanon ba? Hinumduman nyo na ito pero may ang hari. Muna mo ko, you are so focused to the gift, but you forget the gift giver. Oh. So muna, uh, importante kayo sa itong balanse nyo itong kinabuhi. No? We have time for our family, works, and it's very important ang ginoo. Okay, it's very clear in Matthew 6.33, it says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God, no? Muna na ano, and all of His righteousness will be given to you. So, kunaan na ganit ka sa ginoo nga, sige ka gasip. Like me, I started from nothing. I started from zero. But when I started serving the Lord, everything was put to order. Karun lang. So, naitabuan ni Rong kining bagyo nga sa ning udet grabe nga ang mga damages guba hasta ako guba pero i did not regret these things happen nas malipay ko kay when i started this dire kay na wahim jud ni sibu pagsugod dili na ko kasugod sa mga family kay under contract na sa spilite under contract sa globe lock in tag 2 years, 3 years, kung saan man ako ni. Maghuwat ko 2 years, why kwan? Giyabot ang bagyo. Naguba ang tanan. Ako, nag-rebelt ko na yun dito. But ang atong mga upunan ito, apang mga rebelt. So, katungil ang contract, malo to. Guys, ang provider mas wa makaprovide. So, they have the opportunity to transfer to us, ay nagkapuliki ko. Si, nahutang ko kong materials. Muna yun ko nga, basta nakas kinoo. What, you just leave everything to the Lord because siya na ang bahala ni mo. Kisa may magdahom nga, kusus, paghuwat pa kong two years, ano yung uman nga, uh, ma, human yung ilang contract? Uy, giputol sa kinoo. <laughs> so, yun ko na, na, na. You don't know what the Lord wants in your life. Just allow the Lord to move in your life. No? Wala nga akong pasabot, no? So, don't worry. Just wait and wait. Even my wife, in my old life, iba ba, Master Malo, nga bad lungon kay ko? Kay wa may lungon nga good. Nga good. Bad, maging <laughs> bad lungon. No? So, my wife has been praying for my change. It took her 28 years of prayer before I was changed. Muna, had she stopped praying on the 27th year, thinking that there is no more hope for me to change, what ako mingunan eh. Muna nga, continue to pray, pray. Do not stop praying. Remember, praying is asking, not demanding. Just wait and it will come. True. Very true. Hmm? Sometimes without, we forget the the gift that uh, the giver mm. of the gifts and motong nahitabo sa mo 
na we, mm. we were comfortable already Muna. and then when I just felt that kind of void eventually yeah. it was God calling us already yes to me you are a sleeping instrument the Lord planted you there in the family mm. to awaken everybody nga nung sleeping man tayo wa man kalihok na yun nga nung we don't know siyarag sa mga anak mo nga nung umsagog ka na lihok de ay ho na unsa de ay kuan man actually wapit ako ka ba like ever since I was like grade school I don't know why kaya nang every time mo bagting na ng 12 noon angelos mo atadyo ko sa chapel sa 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 CIC sa Immaculada. Mm-hmm. Eh wag tambay lang gyud ko ato, makong tambayan ang grade school. Di ko na magpainit. Kani after in high school, same thing. Pa sa patong had... ko ano, na medal dito sa chapel. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> oh, <laughs> dako <niya>. kayo. <laughs> oh, niya pag ano, um, high school same thing. Kanang early kayo ko sa school kay ming naniliaman mi, have to be early. Maabot matunong ko sa 6:30 nga mass. Naay mass ang Mas school. Ka so musing para sad ko, hantod na himo na collector and it was it was like that ba niya sleeping instrument tay kanang ano si ko ka ba. <laughs> But well, siguro uh-huh. kanang um, I'm just yeah. not during sure that time, yet. during that time remember <laughs> that you're searching. Mm. Searching kani ka ngita di ko kay mo jud ani ang nagigamit sa Ginoo. Mo mm. mato na worry ang imong mama during that time but sila sa loob sa sila kibaw ano na worry sila they are just worried worried sila nga pasig madaka dito sa lain grupo matuk ipasood siya during that time she was still deciding which one is the real one diba ah kay ni explore siya og other kuan mm-hmm. other oh. denominations oh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. i had friends also from other faiths mm-hmm. so what so, Story, I mean. go anyway, if you're searching, just participate in the seminar. After that, you decide whether where to go. Nindot ang kayang vision. Nindot kayang vision. During that seminar, the Lord shows her. Doon sa Gipadungan, there was the chair, the chair of Jesus. But empty chair. Remember, in chair ka na ko. Pagbalik niya, There was the chair with Jesus there. Puna ay kung this is the church na yun ta imong biyaan mo tu ka sa laing a chair, but that chair wala si Jesus because that's not the chair of Jesus. Mm-hmm. The chair of Jesus is the one na imong gitaliglan. So balik siya. So mo na na nga it's a calling. Grabe ang ginoo nga paggamit niya nung no? since then. No, no, no. Nga naman sa ito, nga ni Apil ka, how did you feel back then when you were asked to join? Oh, kuwan, grabe. Uh, uh, Nakik-debate pa ko ni tatay. <laughs> Kung gilibati si tatay. <laughs> okay, during that time, di ba, on fire kay ka, because mm. somebody actually, Started you know, broke the, down the mm. word for for me. Because um, growing up, marag, we just listened to the wali of the mm. priest and that's it. There's mm. really not much room for yeah. engagement. Kuwan siya lagi, usayan ni mga pare. Kamu mga pare, <laughs> katakan lah mo gwali di mo. Ayaw ba? <laughs> aku balungun yun aku sila. I'm, I'm, I'm already 80. Kan sila, But, younger no sila na aku. <laughs> Patay yun siya tatay. Uh, tatay siya kita. Pero, I know, um, responsibility sa aku uh, growing up, I should have, you know, explored more and attended more sa kate- katekesem. But wala kayo na expose. We just have the CLF classes. And, uh, so, and our religion uh, <laughs> classes yeah. so, kana lang yun. and then um unsa gyud ang question miss malu what Why? how did you feel did, and uh, wh- what convinced you kay kuan man ako i i i believe i am bili- a believer nga mm-hmm. kanang everything that happens to us giplano na, na sa Ginoo our our victories yes. our defeats yes. part na sa sa plan so i was wondering also what kay nam gyud pon tay choice true, diba? true. so what brought you to that point in your life na before ka ni Sulod and until such time, ni Sulod yeah. ka. Well, well, The... Mr. Malo. Huwag <laughs> <laughs> mo ito ka sa pikas, maminaw ka, it's very convincing. Yung una ni Maguni, when you interpret the Bible, there are two kinds of interpretation. ECGC and exegesis. ECGCs means what you understand. You interpret what you understand. 
Exegesis is the way we interpret the Bible, the Catholic way. How do we interpret that? We listen to the hierarchy. Because pagbilin sa ginoo, dito sa mga apostol, wala pa may Bible. Wala magdaladalag Bible sila when they preach. Parabol ang teach you sa ginoo. Then, sa tanang mga binuhat ni Jesus, naasap mga apostles, when the Lord established the church, Matthew 16, 18 to 19, Peter, you are the upon this rock, I'll build my church. Dito na nauna pa ang pagsuwat nila sa dihang ni Bia na si Jesus. Una pag ipangsuwat nila ang mga nangitabo. Now, only the author can interpret what he wants us to interpret. Not the person who can uh, read and interpret it by themselves. Kaya dako mga yung diferensya. Even Jesus does not speak Latin. He le Hebrew. Mm -hmm. He even speak. Ang uh, yung yung dialect is Aramaic. Mura bang taga sa Sibuano pa dili taga siyudad taga sambuan, di ba? Ninumbro mo ka ng inigawas sa sakyanan sa series mo dili sa siyudad. <laughs> busy kayo si Piti. Tiri 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 mm. busy kayo na. Pag abot as may Santander mo yun, tide, tide. So, lahil-lahil na kita o ka. You have to listen to the church because it was the church that Jesus established. Mm. Yeah. So, it was the church who write the Bible. Mm -hmm. The Bible was not written for the church. Ang ila kong gibasihan ka ron, sa lain mga denomination, is the Bible. Kaya mo may ila na matanog bot. But kita ng Catholic ko, kita mo yun sa Apostolic Succession. So we listen to the church because it was the church that the Lord has built. Dili man tanan, dili tanan ng nesuwa sa Bible, pero naa sa mga gitit sa church. Nang we believe in tradition, they don't believe in the tradition because they do not have tradition. Let them and sila. What you say about the tradition? So to your question, Ms. Mag, there was really resistance at the start. Ah, so nagyod, amputid ka ng point. And then, eventually, marag tatay, marag siguro grabe yung prayers ako, ma'am. Mo appeal jud ko. During that time, I had to defend for my thesis pa. So tatay was gracious enough to like rearrange the schedule para yun mo appeal ko. And during the healing of hurts, marag dito yun ang realization na there was this vision that was shown to me. Na, you know, there was this kind of amazing big throne that I saw. Um, mm. It sim, according to Tata, it symbolized the the church I was going to. Mm. Na, no matter how nice, um, how kind of kind of beautiful their messaging is mm. and all, but it's it's not where no one is sitting in the throne, mm. Mm. And, and God wants me to go deeper. But ultimately, what made me decide was that um, because. Ang whole family na ako nakatend sa seminar. Kanya na ako ano ako ra? Unsa di ako sala oy? Ano ako ra mga collection? Kamo di ay ano ba so? Ano ako ra mas? So eventually sila tanan ng appeal and all of us had our different experiences of healing. Na to the point I I liked what I saw. This is what I want for my family. Nga there's unity, there's peace, there's there's just love. Grabe ang miracle making segment and afterwards like the life that we had was m what i was longing for mm. inana na mas closer na me to the lord mag serve na me so that's why i eventually got into the youth ministry and all but um uh, <laughs> so so the search at that time you felt you found what you were looking for yeah yeah and for then sure. the blessing yeah. since then she read man she read your life just like me when i surrender everything to the lord she read Muna akong ikaingon sa atong televiewers, the Bible is not enough. Mayingon mo nga, Bible alone, akansiha rin nyo. Kaya wa man yun makumplito ang Bible. Those are few teaching from the Lord to us. But if you want to go deeper, you have to research. Nay, John 21-25, very clear in the Bible. Unsa man din na. Now, there are many other things that Jesus did. If they, if they were all written down one by one, I suppose that the whole world could not hold the books that will be written. So, di yung tanan. Muna nga, kinanglan yung mga references. Kinanglan taong 
ang church mang gudyod ang una muna ni hibaw jud sa unsay na hitabo sa kinabuhi ni Jesus muna importante no <laughs> yes amen so from from that um happening no in one setting lang and one recollection mm-hmm. mo to mga answers what happened after that okay i'm glad you asked because <laughs> it it's not a bed of roses afterwards of course grabi ang correction along the way um and ang uh, ako nakita lang yun like mas ni dako lang gyud mo understanding on how life should be and how we should move forward as a family so um During that time, I was graduating. My mom just transitioned to another company. And yeah, my brother decided to take um, med school. Siya. My sister, mm. dentistry. So like, we, we are also having all these expenses, right? Yeah, as a family, it's um, uh, spirituality ang atong kinahanglan um, i-atiman. There's also finances. There's also all these um, basically more administrative work within the family. So motto when when we were going through this there were challenges of kind of financial distress na kind of um, w- how should we address this moving forward but you know motto ngingon ni tatay na there was grace without na there were even if there were challenges at work but ang ang motion or ang ginatudlo sa church is just continuously receiving his grace at the eucharist and praying the rosary for um, veneration and for guidance and protection yeah. you have all these kind of persistent activities that's being taught in the church in the catholic church yamurag mm-hmm. good ang ni sustain sa to move forward in the faith and when it felt like we were re- totally surrendering to the lord bitaw and we have all this support mga sacraments we have this community of believers also sige mi appeal ato og prayer meeting the entire and, family and worship yeah I, um not all the time but mm-hmm. murag at least we had that um, within the family so eventually that led us to where we are now um daghan og challenges but at the same time na asad murag ang ano bitong murag we felt like there was protection along the way mm-hmm. na every more guided ang among step And there was really provision. That's it. Provision. How could my mom ever, kana, or and my father, uh, employee lang siya sa government, um, was able to live a life of integrity at the same time. Send my my brother now is a neurosurgeon. My sister mm-hmm. now is a dentist. And we we don't say nga kana, we are living luxuriously, but kana comfort comfortably. comfortably. It, it, just enough. <laughs> And I think that's very important. Just enough, lang po. Okay? Mm-hmm. If we have a lot said, too much of it, we might turn against God and forget Him. Mm-hmm. But if we have so little, we might curse Him. So, Marag, Jesus was just really giving us enough. We enough were enjoying for what we life. Need. Yeah, and and for a little bit of wants also. Uh-huh. Na, na we get to travel, mm-hmm. and the same likewise for me also. Na, as I was transitioning um, sa career na ko, so good palang ko. Um, as a youth, where uh, God was already providing so much that I can bear. Nga. Wow, suddenly, hala, pwede na kong mularga Brazil. This was a story mm-hmm. on its own. Nga. I prayed hard to God. Nga. Lord, ganaan ko mong appeal anang World Youth Day sa Brazil. Mm-hmm. I asked my parents about it. Ma, can you send me there? Han, wala tay budget, Anna. How, 200,000 good to. So, you know, I what I did, nagsalig ko sa ginoo. I went straight to the Blessed sacrament, and for one whole day, kapuyo ko, sige ko pray, I want to join this. Lord, if it's your will, if dili, then redirect me. Maybe this career, um, it's not gonna provide for that, so redirect me. And hila ka, jud ko. Onya, um, since I'm in sales, no? Um, then the very next day, on same message ni Lord, Hana, just show up to whatever you need to show up for. So, you show up ko sa akong meeting, uh, meeting in the morning, meeting in the afternoon and guess what i just made a sale that day that allowed me to pay for my ticket to brazil ingana so murag ang blessing ni lord was there and ang ako alang gid ato total surrender mm-hmm. and god has been gracious so far mm-hmm. 
Well, there there is a common uh, I don't know, uh, case or incidents no nga moingon ang uban na kung magpaduol ka sa Ginoo at bangan sad ka og trials or sure. temptations and did that happen to you and if it did how did you deal with it? Um, there were a lot of temptations syempre because uh, I guess kung magpaduol sad ta sa Ginoo um, mm double pod ang efforts other side to bring us down. Well, I will explain that uh, side. Okay. <laughs> Actually, that will really happen. Mm -hmm. But, itawag kas gino in order to uh, mold you to be strong to fight those uh, trials. No? Muna mo yung kung uh, maglakaw ka sa tunukun nga, uh, if you are a uh, traveling, walking to this uh, thorny or rocky road, remember always, the Lord will give you a strong shoes to walk, to reach the other point. Muna, did you ka? May tabo nga mag-failure ka basta nakas gino. Because things will really happen. Kung wapa ang taka ma-hidol sa gino, makasood sa mga inunani nga mga group, wala, tumba ka na. But the Lord give you all the strength uh, so that you can pass through it. No, mona na. Eh, uban ko mingo sus, madol kus ginoo na ano man. May tabo yun na. Ganil lang kay na na magas ginoo. Ah, makatabo ka yun. Mona na. Mona. Mona, sister Malo. Na may siguro yung mga kuan na na ni Mona na. Ako pagi pang tanaw ang mga comments. Di ko kakita sa comments. I don't know why. Ako lang suwayan. <laughs> ah, sige lang, padayo lang sa takay. <laughs> Ikaw sa igaling ni Nini. Sarana. Sige. Galing dyan. Oh, oh, gigaling. So, kato, na incident. Yeah. And kato, when you said the trials, did it, how did it affect you as, you know, young lady? Growing up, and then bago pa biya siya to trabaho tayo, morag yes. bago sa imong career, nag in the real world ba? Kaya ako tanaw man gud gud ane niya before, kanang sheltered gani, buotan nga bata, ingon ana ba? Kanang ay karon ragay ko na karyalize na simba de siya. Yung ano ang klase ng uh, apido? Oh. Kanang buot o tan. Ah, in check man ang tan. Buot o may play ng buot. Tina ni mo, <laughs> limchu. <laughs> so, how did it also? Um, shape you or mold your your life, especially kay bag upasad ka in the real world ba? Nga ka nang di nakaayo as sheltered as you were in the Catholic schools that you went to. Yeah, um, yeah, that's that's very that's that's usually the case now. Um, if I'm able to enjoy these things when I was younger, mm. pero, um, when I was transitioning into adulthood or like going into the workforce, um, at that time, grabi akong hard. For the youth ministry, okay. So, I would come here. I would, uh, we would have these kind of gatherings, and somehow I just felt na um, for it went on for months. And yamura, there was just this kind of longing. Um, mm. I don't think I can sustain this. I need to, you know, get to work. That's what. Mm. That's how I did it. So. I need to get to work to earn an income so that I'm able to support. And so, you got to the point that you were torn between yeah, your activities service, in the church, the service, the and, service and yeah. the reality that yeah. you also need to earn. Yeah, and I also saw a lot of youth, out of school youth, where they also need mm. that kind of kind of support mm. and mm. starting to work. So, where this eventually molded me ba, to to um, look at the bigger picture, then, because Billy man said, "But but but then." Continuously, like serve and praise the Lord, and then we don't do anything to also mm. sustain our, kanang, atong ato ang you know we are human beings after all. We also need, ana uh, income. We also need you know to pay the bills and mm. all that. So, moto na, uh, I transitioned into work, and transitioning into work also. Di man sad ang environment niya mura godly po. Uh, they are conducive for what you were used yes. to in serving. Uh, uh. So it's the total opposite. So grabe good ang challenges and uh, it always boiled down to the decisions I was making daily. Mm -hmm. So daily there's the good decision and the bad decision. Magito and and what how I make that decision is through what standard I have set for that day. So the time I was still 
you know, bago pa lang ko na get into the Catholic faith, bago mm. pa lang ko na kanang really, you know, trying to be intimate with the Lord. So, dungan pag yun sa imuhang career nga kuan, yeah. path po. Oh, at that mm. time, full of doubts also because sa youth, ko, Lord, unsa man imong calling na ko basta you're calling me to can I give up everything and follow you. Okay, na na ba? So niabot ay gaana na ko ay. Oh, oh, but but then wait lang. Um I'm also why am I then educated and have these things and, and why am I, uh, I just got accepted to this work? Oh uh. yeah. My mom also wants me to help her in her business. So, uh. so I'm so torn. But ni ni sabay lang jud ko. And I just let went with the flow. And uh, moto, um there were challenges like to be, to be honest, I medyo nabiyaan ako ang youth ministry because um, I had to focus on the work also. And, uh, so, um, dili. Uh, also, I've, I've made a lot of missteps along the way. Okay, di medyo chakari ka yan. Mm. Right? But ultimately, what I realized, well, there was this pattern already. Nga. There are moments when God breaks me. Nga, when He breaks me, mabalik ko sa iya ha. And, and I think those are gentle corrections from him to continuously mold me mm. into a better person. Reminders. Reminders, yeah. So, manesh. That's how mm. I dealt with it. This is about time that we have to be serious. Actually, it's like this. Time management is very important. Okay. Time pass. Just like ni Shirley Bilyesa. Open na to mga guests, no, Shirley? Wala pa. We will have to. Mm. After her healing, grabe mo itong iyang cancer. She was healed. She was serving, no? Sa kasa ko, kuyog sa siya. Mm. Then suddenly, she went to states. Dito. Seven years na wadyo siya. You know what? Just last year, before pandemic, nauli siya. Pag uli niya, so good to see sir. Ning siya di na siya balik kay. Mm. Sir. Balik. Yes, Lord, thank you. I, I need uh, instruments. Here comes. Yan ang pusihan na ni balik. So, ingon na ni Baron ba? Mm. The Lord is grouping together again. Kay kikinang lad yu kayo ta. Kay kita dili kay unsa. Kini nga community. We never stop going around serving. Yes. Tana ka sa ubang community na unong sila tungo sa pandemic. Yes, Pilar they know what you are. Dili lang ka mo palit ang buwak, okay ra. <laughs> Kay virus man, palit ka. No. So, uh, wala mo na. We travel, no? Why? They know what you are. Even travel. katong mga na-lockdown during the pandemic area, lockdown areas nga, epicenter, nag-healing pag ka dito, di ba? Yes, so, so muna nga, kung nga, dili mata ang imadlo. Just like lockbit lang, no? tomorrow we have a seminar. I had a new teaching that I want to impart to people about this Last Supper. This is something new to you. When uh, I interpret this in the Bible, the same ang output, but in the middle, do not differentiate. I am talking about the fourth cup. Because there were four cups there that they are using when they have the, the uh, Last Supper. Jesus did not drink the fourth mm. cup. Then I will explain why. You know, can I? Just be there tomorrow, listen to this. This is a new teaching. Uh, do not purpose. Why did Jesus did not drink the wine that the woman offered during the time when he was carrying the cross in the middle of that going to Golgotha. She was so tired, pain in her body, in his body. Unya kanang thirst kay init mga ina, init mga ito. Pag office babaywa niya imna. That wine with myrrh, kanang myrrh, doon na halo ng murag anesthesia, ng mga sa pain. He did not drink that. During pag-abot nila sa Kurguta, dahil yun ang wapas siya gilansang, dunulat siya sa Sundao, he did not drink that. Why? You will know that tomorrow. Ah, may pa-teaser si tatay. Yeah, so ugma, no? So kanita nantay ka ng, makakita naman tayo rin nun, ay mawagtang, ay madugang, pero nang sa times, ang nangawagtang, mabalik. So, kuan yun na, you've seen all that happen na yun tayo. Yes, ah, The Lord does not want you to be away. 
Okay, he loves you so much. Uh, Tawon ka yun niya, no, tawon. Mm. Wala nga, naadyo tayo kitawag rin ng department nga lost and found. <laughs> Nang yung lost and found? So, ano dahil si Hannah na lost the eye? Wala. Ah. <laughs> Kuan lang, na-busy. Oh. Ano, importante ka yung time management. Mm. The Lord understand that. Mabitaw, kamu mga asawa, mm. Domingo, tuwa na mo tibok adlaw sa simbahan. No. One mass is enough. Di kay tuwa na katanan. Hindi ko rin mo sa inyo, wala na ninyong bana. Tuwa sa buwangan. Tibok adlaw. Time management yun. Time management. Even God does not want you to give all your time to Him. Ayaw na na yung nga. Sell everything and follow me. Mm. Actually, the meaning of that is leave all of your baggages. Tanani mong bisyo, biyae, kuyog ka na ako. That's the real meaning of that. Mm. No. So, that, 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 mga Kung akong ibaligyan, tara na ako nga mga negosyo niya, mapalo ko niya. Mahurot mo, anak ko, ika. Taba, mm. So, dili di ay ka ng literal nga bi ang mga butang ni mo, dili di ay. Mga mga, kay you always Interpret the Bible literally. Mm. Mm. Oh, the ba si Brother Nap Kamacho ni message the dayon. <laughs> Ingon siya watching from Pitos. Good morning, Tatay Dodong and Sis Malu and your beautiful guest, Sis Hana. <laughs> oh, so, siya Hello, my instrumental, the ba for bringing yes. you. Ngan naman po nga. Family, family friend. Mm. Ah, family friend. Yeah. Okay. Oh, may buntag din na Doc Nap. Nya nay uban diri mga nagtan-aw sige salamat sa inyong pagtan-aw sorry karon pa ko nakalili sa karon pa na ko na open ang comments unya okay. <laughs> so unya um nag na convince na ka sa imuhang path to take no in terms of your faith mm -hmm. mong career is off to a great start no it even brought you to Brazil so ang kuwang na lang gyud love life so <laughs> where did love figure out in that entire journey you know, <laughs> ako yung Sometimes, we follow our feeling. Ah. Muna ha? God give us intellect. God give us heart. Mm. But muna ako yung kaya nyo. Do not allow your heart to control you. You must balance that, your intellect and your heart. Yes. So, dapat to nga, na, balance. Oh, yes, balance yun. Ano yun, nas tutunlan pa siya. Okay, huwag dili ko na mabalance, magkuba ka man. Mm. Why did God give us the wisdom? God give us love, but importante yun, i-balance yun na ni mo. Nga nung naabot mo ka, anak tayo, nga nung tala naman kung love life ni Hana. Mo, nang ako yung tambag niya. Ah, tambag, okay, oh, okay. Kinang lang balance yun ni mo. <laughs> okay. 50-50 yun na. Uh. Do not allow the love to be 60% or 61%. 50-50 yun na. 50-50 yun. Oo. Ay, usahe ko. Maude na nga ka ng kuantay kaming Dennis, amigo, mig MWF, kontra mig TTH, 50-50. Sabo. Dali, ay, peace. Basta okay raman nga, 40 ka 60 si Dennis. Ah, wala. Wala. So, okay. Pag binyo na mo, pag binyo na mo, you are one already. Ah, so, so, the balancing there is 51-49. Kasi may 51? Ang lucky yun. Oh? Yes. Ano man? Kay, kami mang lucky. Mm, kamu, kamu <laughs> pula mo mo kami sobra. Ah, no, no protesta. <laughs> Batas gyoy, depende. 4951. Tu nga ta ini glabang, inyong di kolor among puti na. Gyoy, mayo mga akoy magbot. Mayo gani ko akoy manglaba, akoy manglaba. Ah, sakto pa de. Akoy magluto. Pa de, pa de, pa de. Siya gyoy magbot. Sakto na. Pa de. Oh, tawon is hana. Love life. How was where did I love life will answer it for me? <laughs> Yeah, to well, reminders well, well, well. to the viewers. Nindo yun know, na direct from the mouth, no? Mm. Uh, <laughs> okay. Love life. Currently. Oh. <laughs> Currently. Currently. Currently ba? Is, na, is that your question? It right? depends on, on the journey well, also. Um, go on lang. Let's talk, let's not talk about the past. <laughs> <laughs> Kaya move on natang uh -huh. <laughs> na tayo. Nilabay So, Karon, currently, you have, you have um, a relationship. Yes, mm. yes. Uh, That's good. We go to the same work and actually um, 
ano, bago pa kami. So, mm. um, I'm just happy that so far this person has been very, or like he's really putting God in the center of the relationship. Uh, that's good. So, um, I'm praying um, still that, you know, it's still the will of the Lord that will prevail. Um, but so far, naman, Marag, um, ano, we're, we're still praying for um, the grace um, mm. to, you know, if this is His will, um, move forward. And if not, then, you know. Okay. That's good. Mm -hmm. Kanang kuan para mm -hmm. sentro gyud ang Ginoo. Oo, oh, anam niyo na. Mo ba nay problema sa uban ba nga magtiayon? Mm. If you will not put God in the center of your life, no nothing is bonding you together. Kana may tiban ana ang ah. Ginoo jud. Mm. Mm. Mo na nga importante jud ang Ginoo. Mo na ningon sa Father Peyton nga if family that prays together stays together, ipunan ko na. If family that prays together and eat together stays together. Kay kargado sa ko nakita karos mga pamilya, kanya-kanya. Ikamata, mga bata, mga aon, pak, skwila, banan, lakaw, sa trabaho, sawa. Why don't you say time nga mga aon magdungan sa, sa kalamisa? There you talk whatever is the problem and after talking the problem discussing it leave it there ayun nagdada kay mo man kargado sa pagtiayon sige away sige guys good sa mga past mistakes after discussing pang ilan sang dira ayun nagdada even me and my wife since sa akong new life it's been 29 years never a single day that she discuss about the mistakes of my past life. Do I? Oh. Is she a historian? It's already past. <laughs> Everything belongs to the past. You cannot move forward if you keep on looking back. Mm. Move on. Uh. So, pa move on? Delete us on. Delete us on. <laughs> Mo na move on. Uh. So, how did your experiences also in the past kanang bring you to where you are now? Um, I moved on. Charot. Ito ko kang tatay. Move on. Beta. Move on. Dili tas on. Dili na tas on. Siya siya. I'm glad. Because not everyone by you. Bihay. Buhian. Juda yun. Bihay. Sa idugayan. Diba? O kay ang uban mong God. Not just in relationships. Even in experiences. In hurts. Even in elections. Others ka nang... Do not move on. They instead they become bitter, and it breeds a new kind of feeling in inside. It it makes you harsh. It makes you toxic to others. So I'm glad that you know. Mo na ako ng gitan ako karon talking about politics. Why do they have to destroy each other? Talking the others. Personal. Oh no, mga ano ba? Just. Show to the people on say mung platform what you can do for the country. Oh, they can dao to mung dinao time. See, mga ad hominem attack so mau na choose and vote wisely. Ah, so kana I totally agree with you, Tay and Miss Maluna. When we're with God, mung God, ang iyang the the spirit. Of the fruits of the spirit, well, gentleness, compassion. If we come from that space, I don't think we would be in those moments of discussion. Mm. Na. Mm. Like, if we just have to do that, then we will do it. Yes, yes. And if we truly live it, then mm. um, I think the world would be a much more peaceful True. place to live in. But Ilang, mm. yang will be done. Onya, how how were you also you and your family and and your ikaw gyud? How 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 was it during the when the pandemic hit? How did it affect you as well? Oh, um, okay. So, like I said, there are many challenges, no? Mm -hmm. And 2020 was so hard for me. Ing nanti ka mis malu tay. Um, so, so I had this business. I started this business for three years since 2018 and then 2020 hit and suddenly 
lisod na ang close contact. So, service-based akong business. It was a salon ah, okay. in one of the malls. Yeah. We had to close. It's either mo continue mig bleed um, not sure kanos amo abli balik ang market. And people were kanang hadlok sila. Mm. Mo go to salons, de ba? Okay, yeah. Once in matakdan, we didn't know mm. what COVID was. Yes. So, eventually had to close. And that took a toll on me. I was super depressed. Um Idako juko pag ayo, sis malu. And then also, so March manto nag lockdown, and we had to make a decision that year to close. Because Eventually, you closed on we that had to year. Close. Yeah, this it by was, December. But it was actually thriving na. Oh, it was it was, it was up. up. Yeah. yeah uh, then December we had to close. But you know what? In May of 2020, my father galisod po siya ginhawa. So we thought talaga COVID ni. And lockdown pa to, I had to rush him to the hospital. He, we went through the triage, and then lo and behold, dili siya COVID positive. But yana ang doctor, your heart is only operating at 10 percent. Kinahanglan naka open heart surgery. Oh yana my! Yana ang doctor diretso. So we had to get him on a operation. But my dad said dili ko magpa open heart surgery. Uh, di na lang ko ane siya. So what's a better um, treatment for me? and into angioplasty. So, we did that two days lang, and of course, the bill was a lot. Um, two days lang mi sa hospital, na okay ang iyang operation, ni, ni recover siya dayon, but like the bill was almost two million pesos. But, and this is pandemic when like lockdown. Things are really. <laughs> and no work, no pay, but mm -hmm. you know, praise God, praise God that I'm in the insurance industry. My father has an insurance with us, so we didn't have to worry about the expenses. And at that time, so grabi ang amo ang challenges also. Um, so my brother at the time was about to take the exam. Like to on siya for his neurosurgery. Stressful ka ay. Yeah, and also he had to go to work, 36 hours duty, exposure nila, medical mm. field man siya. Mm. Likewise, my sister said no work because dent dental. Mm. Ano so? Um, 2020 was particularly hard for us as a family. But God was faithful. Um, na okay akong dad. Eventually, I learned to accept the loss and failure of that business. Mm. And in 2021, mora yung 180 degrees turn. Suddenly, na lift ang akong burden. In fact, during those times nga sad kayo ko in 2020, um, we were able to create a chapel inside the house. And, and, and garden, na, na, na plantita man ta atong mm -hmm. panahuna, di ba? <laughs> yeah. And, uh, so, moto 2021 was, uh, and, um, I would say, our deliverance year. Nga, through all these hardships, mm. um, 2021, marag, di uli anrasad ko ni Lord of something better. Mm -hmm. So, He took away, God has given, mm -hmm. God has taken away. So, and, uh, marag, moto na back, back in shape also. Mm -hmm. um, and hinahinay, like, um, it was a koan. It was a more a molding of my character. I would say. At the end. Mm. So so now things are starting to settle down. You are in a way better place than yes. 2020, 2020 than 2020, right? Yeah. Mm -mm. Mm. So and then kanang karon, what what's in the works for you? Unsa may naa sa immediate future for Hana? I wish I can see, but um, <laughs> koan, I'm just following uh, what. I need to obey, right? I need to obey, continuously obey what I'm called to do, like so work. And, uh, um, and then uh, right now we're, I don't know, in terms of work, I'm just really, kanang mura ko kanang horse karon, yan na ay blinders. And mm -hmm. I'm just focusing Focus lang on yun. one thing at a time because mm -hmm. um, my history has taught me that. Um, if I am not focused on anything, I don't finish anything. I don't get anything done. Mm -hmm. So kinda, I'm focused on my work. At the same time, I make sure that I'm, um, of course, working on my relationship with the Lord. Mm -hmm. um, I need to be more intimate with Him because if I'm not, um, I will fall to kinda, the things of this world, which um, I've been down that road and it was not. Kung wala si Lord sa akong life, it's just so empty. So, kana taking it day by day, cause had look said ko. I'm actually very fearful right now um, on where he's leading me. Yeah, man. Well, and, um, because 
I have so much responsibility right now. Um, we have over 1,200 manpower. Um, we're operating nationwide. And I mean, we're, we're sharing careers, we're sharing opportunities and life-changing decisions mm -hmm. to our clients. So you're feeling the burden yeah, I'm feeling over that. these people's lives. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, so I just feel so responsible mm -hmm. and about it. Uh, uh, I'm asking the grace of God to, to be with me during this time. It's not, it's not going to be easy, I know. And to lead, to lead people. I want someone to lead me, but it seems like I'm called to lead. And, mm -hmm. and so it's so, I know, kulbaan ko. Well, just leave everything to the Lord. You know, when I enter in this internet business, my competitor are giants. Giants, yes. But the Lord said, you are David. David. So I started uh, the internet business. When I tried to reflect, ang mga tao kakinanglan yun ang tinuuray ng internet. Yung affordable. In my own capacity, I was able to make a package that very cheap. I imagine I can even go up to what palang ni six hundred pesos. You have internet and you have cable TV. If you subscribe from cable TV in a company here, at least the na kung package kay hatag libre, that is around five hundred fifty pesos nila. Kung yung doon ako yung internet ihatag, 600 pesos. Sa ito pa, 50 pesos lang ang internet. I just want to help, you know. Kaya, mura man yun ako yung aim, helping people. Mura, i-aimos ginawa ang tanan. Nagubah ang tanan. Center man yun ta din eh. Bohol. Plus, direkta pag yun ka sa on the ground, kung mas familiar ka kapulih ke itag panahon. Grabe kayong gino. My margin there is, ay sus, bilan lang ko ng margin ako. But dili mong ako profit conscious. Ang ako is service. Putawag ka sa ubang kumpanya, binuan o nakatood. Ang ato, within that day, pinakadugay next day to anak. Karun lang o. Problema ko pag open ako sa danawin ko, Lord, saan mo na ko ni Lord, ngayon, yung tayo naman yung tao sa danawin niya. Puro man nakalakin. What happened? Wapakabangon taon sila. Ako ni Jesus. We are installing more than 10 a day. Grabe. In fact, sabi ko, ang mga tao sa nato, naamag ko every first Friday, nagkatang ko lecture nila. Input. At ako input. At ako input. Mamuli na sila, alas 6, alas 7 na sa gabi, just to finish their work. So ako sila yun, kamo, nakita na ako ang inyong sincerity, your faithfulness to the company. Ako nitawagan ganina. Okay. Nihatag naman sa ako ang feedback si Eva nga, nakakita na sila o bits ng tuwing ko nga. Panganda mo ha, pero tanawa ha. Ngayon ko tanawa sa taytay kung ano sa, kung saan oras sa ang Anticipated mass sa Saturday. Kamong tanan, manimba. Kaya pagka-Sunday, dadunta mo sa beach. Wow! Simba sa daan. Sige po, tinawagan. Ito na. Kaimutang na sila. Imagine, nagsugot ang Oktober. Karun, 800 na itong subscriber. Krabi. Pas-pas. Oo. So, paspasan nyo na ito. Way abog. So, kanong fears ni Hana, Tay? Ayaw lagi. Fear is not from God. Let go and let God. When you trust in Him, He sees everything inside us. When He sees that we are really... Look at Abraham. Nangayaw siya ang anak. Niingong ang ginotagaan. Hindi kang dili ma... Your children can be called to know. It will be like... The stars. The stars are like the sun in the sea. Usap pa ganit ka buk. Ipangayaw na mas gino. Ipa-offer man. But 
Why reklamo si Abraham? Pidaan niya dito. Sa ipong sa anghel ng nabot. Sa diyang iya ng tangi offering ka na. The Lord has seen your faithfulness. There is a lamb there full of sickles. Use that as your offering. Kada o sa sanasak mo i-explain doon niya. So muna na allow the Lord to move. Don't worry. Kaya siyara ang bahala na. Kaya nainundong ko sa akong istorya na. A lady at the age of 20 gusto na magminyo. E kung din siya, Lord, tagay ko Lord o tall, dark, and ruggedly handsome man. Siya siya pa kanji. Pag-abot niya ang 30, Ingon siya, Lord, hi, man. Why? Nabot siya korinta. Lord, wa pa man. Pag-abot niya, 50 plus. Nangutanan na Diyos siya, Lord, nga naman. Pag-ito bang siya sa kino? Kaya pilihan ka man. Muna nga, just wait for Him. He will give everything to you basta ka maulat na mahuat. In God's perfect time. So do not be afraid. Let that fear go away. Kaya kanang fear ni mo na, mandugay na, sige, mahimo man ang anxiety. Balito mo ni demonyo, makasuda ganun ng pikasti ili, hinihina yun ang kamang ni mo. Then, everything will be worse. Saan din ako? Basta, timan eh. When the Lord is in you, who can be against you? Maan ang fear. Amen. God is for us, who can be against us? So, Karol Han, ang imuhang activities with the youth, taod-taod naman to, di ba? So, siyempre, you worked with a lot of people back then. Do you also not miss it or long for kanang being active again? Oh. In the service, actually, well, uh, <laughs> she will be receiving a an invitation letter <laughs> anytime. No, I mentioned it at that. But um, last year we were in touch. Uh, Miltihan ng good news. Ah, uh, catching up lang. Catching up with mm. some of them. Um, it's uh, sad to hear some news of other youth. Uh, wala na. Mm. But uh, that's the direction right now. Um, I feel like um, I I I have some unfinished business for the youth ba? Mm -hmm. and, and if I can contribute, you know, why not? God has blessed me so much. Idalo pa ba na ko? Di ba? A portion of my time and resources. So, ano lang, um, little by little, in my own little way. And kana, I'm, I'm also uh, excited for kana, to doing again the worship. Mm -hmm. And I just miss it so much na Mata, wala pag ikuha ang talent sa akin na bili iabag ng tingog. Looking forward to that. Betaw. Kaya maayaw man niya bata, talented ka ayos sa akin. Oo. Ibaw ka man ane. Asam yun na maliwat. At tos teacher yun. Tos mama. Tos mama ng papa. So I think I know na. So I'm glad. I look forward to that. Something to make your 2022 pag yun nga uh, start good in a an awesome way. <laughs> uh, Tapos surrender na yun eh. That's good. Ang dot. Dito. So, mga plano. Nindot na ito mga plano muna nga. Well, Punya nana sila may bawa sa kumain. Nipa e announce ang plano. Okay. Manginvite na lang kada e. Betaw. So karon imo hang other family members. Kumu sta man sa sila. Other family members. I mean, you know, I mean the family. As an immediate family. Your immediate family. I mean, de ba ang uban? My brother, my sister. Oh yeah. They're doing. Unsa ilahang ko an po drone activities? Joey, unsa may kwad nyo ron? Joey is our youngest, my youngest sister. Um, ano siya? Dentist. She also in 2020 struggled po tasha, but in 2021 she built her 
dental clinic. Wow. So, naa siya sa Belmont one in Ming Manila. She's mm. doing so well right now. Like, That's good. God's favor is upon her good. Um, well, I mean, oh, oh like, kanang go to clinic siya ba? Because, mm. um, iyahang expertise po, like, she's been trained and in, in Manila mga celebrities ba na yung Oh, wow. But right now, like, she's really, you know, on her own and, mm. nang, nang, she's on to her second, like, invest na siya in second dental chair because she's doing so well, but. Mm. So, nice. you mean to say, uh, her favorite food is pasta, no? <laughs> <laughs> Pasta. Pasta mo yun na ro. Mahilig siya mo pasta. Lame ang pasta. That's si Joey. That's Joey for you. Just she's still single, but that's she. She's in a long-term relationship. Very happy. Ato na sa imbita ko niya Joey. Hey, pata siya story. My brother naman si Kuya John niya si Tatay. Asa mo siya na sa im? Ponsar. Um, so. Ano na siya, officially, pwede na siya consultancy. So, he just had, grabe po akong brother. Um, he just, uh, he has his clinic na, Karun, with kauban niya nga mga doctors in Cebu Doc, as a neurosurgeon. Wow. And um, I think he got accepted sa, if I'm not mistaken, sa ACE Medical in Talisay, mm -hmm. as the or, uh, neurosurgeon sa dito. That's uh, nice. Uh, Oo, oh, so... Um, things are doing well. Uh, he has two wonderful, adorable kids. Mm. Yeah, young wives are very, very. Kamarag family, family gin mita na. So that's good. So yeah, lingaw ni mo parents ro. They are all into very, medical. Eh. Mm. They are all into medical. Ang young elder brothers, neuro. Ang younger is dentist. Siya medical sa Insert. Abigay na ako mag-advertising ni kay maayo man ni sila ilahang batch. Beto? But advertising parent for the Lord. Correct, correct. Po anjo, different paths. Yes. But good to know that you all are all doing well. Kay karon is the year of kanang revivals baya, kanang mga revival of the economy and revival of you know how life used to be. Exactly. And the fate also, as well. <laughs> <laughs> How life, no? Because I was here for a week with Marisol. These are my old group. So, na. Wait, 74? Go na on naman sila. Maybe they are preparing there for me. Alahan, na sa taan na, ha? Hindi man kay... I'm 80 already. I did not know nga. Kinginang pa ko ni Edwin na gabi, Oh, now, you can go to the city hall and claim your 25,000 because you reached 80. Ang mga ba di ay? Na di na yung una na. Award, oh. Sige lang, oi. Ato lang ng tanaw-tanawad kung ano sa. Purot-purot mo sila. Actually, frankly speaking, I do not have any any mess anymore mm. they're all gone hello <laughs> 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 how is your life how is your enemies oh, i don't have any 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 mess anymore <laughs> so nga naman mo nagipasaylo ko na kurot sila kamatay so one i nabilin in fact sa among mga bats na mo sa martial arts ay scream Ako yung himo nila ron kining head. Kaya ako na malay, duha na malamin habili yung mga buhi. Himo ko lang Supreme Master. Sige lang, tusod na. Kaya you have to learn from the best and experience kay dakusod nag factor, di ba? Supreme Master. Last man standing. Imukuan pa deka, mo skrima pa deka. Di naman. Di naman. They request me to give a demonstration, and I promised the Lord that I will not handle that anymore. That naroti, gusto mo sila. I tried. Oi, kahit bata ko nilip sakit ko kayo. I left handed mong ko. Kundi yun sorry, dili yun pa sakit na nun. The next day, pag pangawali na ang uban ng bawal na states, nawa ko tanawar ang ginoo. Kundi lini, mo matosikak ko ikanyite. 
Huwag yun to siya mga apil sa seminar. Kaya nengon siya pre, pa seminaron ko nemo, mapariha niya ko nemo nga pabiyaan ng eskrima, asama ko din ako mabuhi. Kaya di lang mangkod. Every day has their own uh, calling. Mga ba ni calling sa ako? Mm. Nengon man yung ginawa na ko, live your first love. Pabiyaan niya na ako, Diana? Nengon na ako. Diana is not my first love. Tagha naman ng agi. Hala? What is my first love? Eh, yeah, ibaw mo na siya. My first love is my martial art. Piyan ako. Hmm. That's it. So I am now having a combat, no? Defense, defending the church. Mm, different kind uh, of combat. Oh, hasta demonyo. <laughs> Betaw. So muna no karon nga ayaw jud mo kahadlo the lord is there no matter what trust in him mm -hmm. kini mga trials kini mga kuana to problema sa atong kinabuhi mabot yun na hey, that is the mission of the devil to destroy a family to destroy human being but he will not win. Do not allow the devil to win. No? Naaman yung gino, gatan ako na to. But when the Lord sees that your faithfulness is there, so si ikaw na mo baliban. Sabi. Mauna. So, why angay kabalakan? Salig sa ginoo ang tanong. Okay. That's poem man, ano? Kanang binisayam ng balak. Mmm. Balak, oh. Sige, ginig man ang lastas balak. Oh, kaayo. Uy, good morning, Daeg. Happy viewing sa mga nagtanaw ka ron sa Hong Kong, Thai. Si Elvan Vuena Maria Delia. Nagtanaw ko na siya. Well, ah, excuse me, sa ano? Hong Kong mga OFW dito. Ato, labi na. Members or not members na ito dito. I have seen sa inyong fifth wave dyan na nila. Grabe man. Oo, grabe. Affected ka. Ayaw ako. Doon na mo yung may ba. If you know somebody nga na i-COVID, let them call me, no? Sa video call. Video call, oo. Okay, mag-pre-over ta. Okay, low-way kayo na sila. Huwag mo sila kapaulian. Basta sakun sila nga mo. Yes. Sa limang ka. Mamatay sila niya. Ang hospital po, no? Asa mo sila mag-rest? Grabe, ang affected ka ayon nga sa fifth wave sa Hong Kong are the OFWs. Oh, wow. So if naamoy yung mga kaila, contact lang yun sa tatay kay para maka, maka healing. OFW, mm. sa meaning OFW? Ito may meaning sa OFW. Only female works, OFW. <laughs> <laughs> diba? <laughs> o yan, may buntag sa mga, sa mga nagtanaw. Good morning, Faith in Action, Tatay Dodong, Sis Malu, and guest watching and joining here from Lapu-Lapu City, si... Nida Inok Butalid. Salamat sa pagtanaw o maing buntag ninyo. Nagtanaw sa si Michael Asuncion. Maing buntag. O si Christina de Lima Lapiz. Gikan sa Inuburan City of Naga. O niya. Nagtanaw sa si Archie Kins Abarquez Cabero. Hello, tatay Dora and Mama Lu. Good morning ninyo. O niya. Ah, okay. Katuday ni message tayo. Nagkan sa Hong Kong. Oasis of Love, Hong Kong. It's here si... Elvan Vuena Maria Delia. Oh, salamat ka. Ayaw ka to ha. I-contact sa tatay. If you happen to know anybody nga COVID victim, tawag lang ko dahil yung litso. Anytime, no? Basta video kay Lisod kayo nang mag-healing ta nga maminaw rata di ta makakita sa naong ba. Gata. We have to discern mo. Video call good. Sige, ma'am. Sis Elvan Vuena, Maria Delia, i-contact lang yun si Tatay Dodong. Unya, 10.45 naman dahi tayo. Mga yun sa ato ang mensahe ni Hana, no? Para sa mga anak like you and also sa mga kabatan unan. Uh, what, what can you share to them about your, your journey in life and para sa, sa mga nagtanaron ng mga mama o mga kabatan unan? Um, okay, I would siguro magsagot ko as a daughter. And to all the daughters out there, Bana, um, uh, you, meet, you might be struggling right now or um, you know, you have doubts or you want to know 
where God is leading you. Like, if if you're at this point now where I'm um, standstill, uh, which I was in most of my yeah, even now, like I, I have these moments of standstill. Asa ko padong Lord, just trust, trust the Lord and seek Him first. Seek Him first. Seek His presence. Find Him. Whatever it takes. Every day. Cannot get first and foremost, and everything will be added unto you. So, it took me a while to truly appreciate kaninga message, but when I started to mm. truly, you know, search for lo- long for Him, you know, He showed up in my life. And everything changed for the better. Mm-hmm. So, kind of for all the daughters out there, um, maybe looking for your future partner. Oh, I feel good. I feel good. Uh, or, <laughs> okay. or maybe you're um, discerning if single blessedness, mm-hmm. but um, just make him your number one priority. Mm-hmm. Part good sa prayer to to guide you, no? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Let him lead. Kana na lang. Let him lead your life. Let God lead. And go on to ano, mga anak, mga kabatanunan ka ron. I know that um, the times right now are different. Um, pandemic, school ninyo has to be online. Wala kay tay community. We're always at home. Mm. And kaya nababad ta sa balay, daghan kayo moments nga magkaawayay because there's too much familiarity already. Mm. But remember na just to be grateful with what you have right now. Wala mo na ego o COVID. Na ego man mo, but you survived it. You know, there's still food on the table. Your family is still intact. Remember to always aspire to unite the family instead of divide. Okay, unsa may padulungan, magsigig tag-away, magsigig sapot, magsigig unsa bicker each other na. Will that give you peace at home? And so, sa mga anak, learn to pagpaubos. Okay, anak man ta. And we don't know any better than our parents. Same sad sa parents. Um, sila po, human man sad mo. Uh, human man sad atong parents. They will also make mistakes. But I think, really, kuhan lang. Kanang surrender and have this heart of mm. musimba lang every day. Mm. And, and try to apply um, the teachings of Christ. Try to be Christ-like. Kana lang. And I think things will be better if we start from there. Thank you, Han, for sharing your your stories and your message oh, to no, viewers. Talking about children, ba? Mm-hmm. I want you to remember always the fourth commandment. Mm-hmm. It says that honor your father and your mother. Mm-hmm. It does not say honor your good father or good mother. No matter good or bad, you have to honor. Okay, this is the only commandment that I promise again. Mm-hmm. If you honor your parents, you will have a long life. If you dishonor your parents, you will have a course from God. Imagine, the course is from God. Muna nga, importante kayo na na ito. Daghan nila nga, wad yun may bawaan eh. Muna nga inyong kinabuhi, wad yun. No, kay, we owe our life to them. Kunwa sila di tamatao. No, muna, you have your time also. You will be parents later on. No, muna nga, bantayan kayo na na ito. So, Mm. Obedience is better, better than, than sacrifice. sacrifice. <laughs> mm. So, kita man ako ang problema sa katawahan karon kun Kung asa tapadong, so una ko magbilin og prayer o healing, I will request my kining ako mga nindot kay tingog ba. Uh, Doon ako i- i-offer ninyo before my prayer ang huy tao asa kapadong. No? Wa, kini at random naman yun niya ito. Ang mayutay, ang dam din eh. So, atong tagaan sila, no? Uh, Brad Alan, uh, Sister Joy, Joan, kini, pangutan o na ito ang atong viewers karun kung asa sila pa doon.
kaiksunan ko din ha sa kanginan. Pangutanon na sa itong kabuling. Ninay na itabu sa itong kalibutan karon kun asa na kitang dapita sa sa bakan sa itong gino. So ang iyon akong tanan sa pagpamiyong sa ilang mga mata. Just focus to Jesus. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Now I want you to focus to Jesus. Focus to Him. Lord, in spite of everything, Lord, in this pandemic, Lord, in spite of the suffering that we have now, Lord, we will not lose hope because we entrust to you everything, Lord. Yes, Lord, we know that we cannot be back to you if we cannot forgive those people who have offended us, those people who hurt us most. Because you said, forgive. For if you cannot forgive, the Father in heaven cannot also forgive you. Yes, Lord. You even said in Matthew 5, verse 44, Love your enemy and pray for those who persecute you. Mga try to remember kung kinsa pa ka itong mga tao ka, huwag pa rin mo na pasaylo. Pasaylo ka ron. Pasaylo ka kay gahuat ang ginoo ka rin mo nga ikaw ang pasaylo. Then, you will be in His fold. If you have a hard time in forgiving, sakit, bugat, but the Lord said, ask and you shall receive. Ask Him to come to you to the deepest part and you can help you to forgive. Then, you can forgive them completely. At this point also, yes, we are not perfect. Ask the Lord to forgive you for all the wrongdoings that you have done against His will. Yes. Walay sala ka din niya mapasaylo. No matter how grave are those sins that you have committed, when you repent and be sorry for that and ask forgiveness, kay karon-karon dahil yung pasayloon ka niya. Yes. In the name of Jesus, I break on His soul. Every ancestral curse that they have received, bondage of the family tree, the spirit of deception and destruction, fear and self-hatred right now, I command you to be broken and to be dissolved in the name of Jesus. Heal Jesus' name. <coughs> be healed. Now, brothers and sisters, to toki sa imong huna-huna. It's in your mind, not in your eyes, to toki. Do na kay makitang hagdanan sa imong atubangan. You can see that staircase of healing prepared by Jesus for you and Him to climb that staircase of healing. I want you to climb. Climb slowly. And when you reach the top, I want you to embrace, to hug Jesus to receive your complete healing. Climb now. Slowly climb. Jesus. Yes, you can see yourself now, side by side. With Jesus, hold him tightly, hold him tightly. Jesus, Lord, rejuvenate, Lord, their system, Lord. Repair what is needed to be repaired in their body organs, Lord Jesus. Shandala manahabala shalama. Heal inside out. Heal body, mind, and spirit in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We praise you, we glorify you, we bless you, Lord. Jesus, thank you, Lord, for your touch and your love in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen and amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Salamat mga kaigsunan. Sa inyong pakigubat ka na mo. Ayo kalimot katong nakaparestro na for tomorrow 8 we will start exactly 8 hour seminar and we will end at 5 no there will be healing from the womb cutting the bandage and then immune system no so ayo mo kalimot 
I'll be expecting you tomorrow. Fourth Cup is the main topic. Shalom, bye-bye. you feel that you can